I've always envied the ability of others to excel in the arts world. How wonderful it would be to be able to play Bach or, or uh, to do a, a jeté <laughs> or, or to be Horatio at the bridge. Um, all of those, uh, I, I think there'd be a tremendous personal feeling of uh, exaltation to uh, be able to achieve that. And just flop your hand on here. Just uh -huh. drop it. There. Okay, you got these big paws. Well, I would hope so. I've got okay. a big body. <laughs> just two fingers, three fingers, whatever. So you just feel the rhythm of that. So you're dancing. I'm ready. Sounds to me that you think that this, that what you're going to do is be a ham for us, a hammy Hamlet. The interesting thing and the ironic thing, yes. um, you've learned this speech. Um, the ironic thing is, this is Hamlet's advice on how not to be a ham. Give me that. Do I, know? I think you know. It. What, what, what? How does it start? Jim? My security blanket. <laughs> find, find your, find. There yes, you go. Yes, yes. You got your focus now. All right. Speak to that person with passion. Speak the speech, I pray you, as I pronounced it to you. Trippingly on the tongue. Okay, I'm going to jump in here and say that wasn't as trippingly on the tongue as I know <laughs> no, you would make. I kind of tripped over the tongue. <laughs> the whirlwind of, of your, your passion. passion. Good. Try that again. And as I may say, find it. And as I may say, the whirlwind of your passion. Be not too tame neither. But let your own discretion be your tutor. Suit the action to the word, the word to the action, that you o'erstep not the modesty of nature. For anything so or done is from the purpose of playing, whose end was and is to hold the mirror up waltz. to nature. But um, I, I knew how to waltz. You knew yeah. how to waltz. Well, <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty rusty myself, yes. so this is good for both of us. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, I'm not very two, good at three. following you, am I? You're, but we're speeding up. We have to go You're light slow. as a feather. I've never been good at following. I've had this complaint oh, before. Is that right? Yeah, I like to lead. Uh huh. Uh huh. Did Nuria say that? <laughs> he liked it. <laughs> he liked it. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I'm supposed oh. to be teaching you how to waltz. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're getting tired. Now. Time for a drink. <laughs> <laughs> He's perspiring. We're working him very hard. Now, why isn't Karen perspiring? <laughs> I think that. You know, I was sort of imagining how much fun it would be to be doing this in the summer in the music garden. Uh, on the pavilion. Yeah, we'd have to practice a few more times. Because that is the minuet. That is the minuet that we're waltzing to. Sometimes asked if there's a secret to fundraising, because I've certainly been doing it long enough. Not really rocket science, it's really quite simple. It's a question of balancing passion and resources, in a sense that the more passion that the potential donor has, the more resources they're going to provide. And what you want to do is release that passion. Thank you. 
Thank you.